someone you loved? Yep. Lewis. Hey, she wanted me to ask. Lee. His name was Lee. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That sounds like a rough day. <laughs> yeah, worst day of my life. I think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah, it's probably for the best. You wanted me to ask. Let's go, AJ. Good night. Night, AJ. Hey. Long day, huh? Yep. Real long. Uh, I hope you know Lewis didn't mean any harm there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. You guys relax. Get some sleep. Feel human for a night. In the morning, come find me. We can talk about making this long term. We can stay? We can talk about it. That looks like a really safe window. It does. Good. This box has so many colors. Well, must have been an artist living in here. What's an artist? It's like a person who colors a lot, draws, does pictures. You mean like 10? Yeah, like 10. Huh. I like to do pictures too. You don't knock. Oh, shit. I, I didn't know Marlon set you up in this room. I just wanted to grab something from the closet. Where the hell is it? Oh. What? That's what I was looking for. It belonged to Sophie. Uh, ten sister. He was asking for more art supplies and stuff, so I was going to. Oh, sorry, we didn't know. No, no, it's it's fine. Don't don't worry about it. Honestly, it's just been sitting here for the past year and no one's touched it. If AJ wants to play with it, it's it's fine. You should probably give the box back. It doesn't belong to us. Thanks, buddy. It's just that Ten wanted it since it was his sister's and all. It's okay. You can finish your drawing, though. I don't mind. Huh. I see you're, um, settling in. Yeah, is that okay? Sure. I guess. I always liked this room. Sophie had, like, paintings and shit on the walls. Lots of color. And Minerva. She was really musical. Not like Lewis, though. She had actual talent. <laughs> she had the most amazing voice. Real bluesy. Marlon always joked that he would scavenge a guitar and the two of them would tour the country. That was a long time ago. After they... Afterwards, Brody and Ten took down all the paintings, and that was the end of it. I shouldn't have even brought it up. It's not a good memory. Guess I just lost my train of thought. Most of us that are still around, a lot of times we have more bad memories than good. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? What exactly happened to them, Sophie and Minerva? They went scavenging with Marlon and Brody out past the safe zone. Didn't make it back. 
It happens. Honestly, I just miss having someone around to talk to. There's just so many dudes. This place can get a little too bro town for my liking sometimes. And I'm not exactly like a people person, you know? I know I sometimes have a habit, have a habit of being a little bit too harsh. You come off all right. I thought you were pretty cool. Oh, um, thanks, I guess. You were pretty cool too, out there against those walkers. Hey, Clem, I'm an artist now. Not bad, kiddo. I should be getting back. Thanks again for the box. You're pretty cool, AJ. See ya. Yeah, see ya. <sighs> okay, Alvin Jr., time for bed. Okay, here. For me? For the wall, to make our home look nice. That's a good idea, AJ. How about here? Uh, AJ? Hey there, what are you doing? This is where I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> what? No, it's not. It's safe under here. No one can get me. Well, it's safe out here too. Did you see the size of this place? It's huge and there are plenty of brick walls to keep us safe. What about the door? What if someone comes in? What if they try to hurt us? What if they steal our stuff? I'll keep watch. I'll sleep with one eye open if I have to. You can't sleep like that. I tried. <laughs> if I stay here, no one can find me. And I can keep guard and watch over you. I can protect us. <sighs> hey, what's gotten into you? Please, Clem. It's not so bad down here. I'll be okay, I promise. Okay, okay, you can sleep under the bed. Here, for your head. Let me know if you get cold. I will. Okay, good night, AJ. Clem? Yeah? I'm glad we're not sleeping in the car anymore. I'll yeah, probably eventually me too. Stay, right? I guess we're gonna find out. Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. Up here! Come on, Clem, this way. Hey, AJ, wait up. Tinsu. Hey, Clem. Thanks for the pencils. I missed having colors. Sure thing. Who are these guys? They're firefighters. That one's a policeman. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These were the people who protected us. Where are they? I've never seen one before. Uh, 
They all died a long time ago, trying to save everyone. Oh, they were weak. What? Oh, no. They were brave. Strong. Now, give it to me and... No, he's mine now. Hey, give it back. No. Hey, you don't even know what they are. Okay, okay. That's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. How you figure? It's mine. No, it's not. Oh, fine. Ooh, Thanks. You go, Jesus. Do you know where something. Marlin is? Used to be I don't know. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. Look. Hey, what'd you find? It's a picture of Marlon and Lewis. It's an Avengers. They're so little. Wow, they've known each other a long time, huh? Uh. Okay. Marlon? Stay back. That's a big dog, man. Whoa, what the hell's going on? Hey, 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 it's okay. Shh. Uh, you said dogs brought back bad memories. I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were so scared of them. But I swear, Rosie's not as frightening as she seems. Was barking and growling at me. I'm Sit, there. girl. She like See? You. She She's like harmless. You. She okay. just needs to get to know you, is all. Mm. Here. I'll show you. Excuse me? Do you trust me? Nope. Don't know you, bro. Rosie. Shh. Just met you Try. yesterday. I promise she's not gonna bite. What you want me to do? Trust her. I'm <sighs> sorry. I can't. No problem. I'm not gonna pressure you. Nah. Rosie, lie mean... down. <laughs> she was the headmaster's dog, back when this place was still functional. Mm. When the world went to shit, he bailed. All the other adults did. Left us behind to fend for ourselves. Wow. Well, what a dick. <laughs> Understatement of the century. Now it's just us kids left. And I'd like it if you and AJ were a part of that. Both of you are plenty capable, and we need that. Here. This is the current state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. What's the trap area? The hunting grounds, more or less. Lewis built some traps out there to catch game. He and Sam are set to go check them today. The greenhouse? Oh, yeah. Well, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. I had plenty of vegetables growing. But it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. Yeah, we, uh, we keep away from that now. I didn't realize how much forest surrounds this place. It's how we've kept ourselves from unwanted attention for so long. Well, for the most part, anyway. That's the only road that leads in and out of Erickson. If you go off it, you'll eventually end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but I took them down. We wanted this place to be hard to find. What's out here? Oh, that's where we fish. I got a shack for storage right here, right along the river. It's secure mostly. You get the occasional walker or two come by. Vine Brody should be heading out there in a bit. That's the train station. There was a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed your car? Pretty sure that place a lost cause. It's a hell of a 
lot of smoke coming from it when we found you two. See these red lines? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. It's been getting smaller over the years, and the food's become more scarce. So, why not go outside it? <laughs> we can't. Whenever someone goes outside the safe zone, bad shit happens. People die or disappear. I just... <clears throat> I could really use the help, Clementine. Taking care of these kids, it's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if, if I don't fix our food situation, I can't lose anyone else. We've already lost so much. Friends, siblings, I, I can't let another kid die. I get it. I know how it feels to lose a friend. Yeah? Well, multiply that by 30 and you'll know how I feel. <gasps> what? Ha. Huh. Shit. Sorry. Jesus. I'm sorry. Sorry? Didn't mean to come off like a dick. Everyone's counting on me to step up. Be the leader they need me to be. I really want to be that for them. You and AJ are two more mouths to feed. But maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds, looking for rabbits. Well, Asim will, anyway. Lewis... Uh, just hope he shows up, if I'm really being honest. Violet and Brody are going up river to do some spear fishing. And hopefully, those two get along long enough to get some work done. Both teams could use some extra hands. Do some Lewis hunting. likes like Yeah. Hunting. Take this. I don't want you getting lost. Thanks. We need all hands on deck if we're gonna find any more food. Just remember to stay in the safe zone. We need you to come back home in one piece. So that means we can stay? What? Do you think I was gonna throw you out? Maybe. Well, as long as we got enough to eat, you're both welcome here. Get him, AJ. All right, let's get going. See you around. Hunting grounds are usually clear of walkers. Sometimes they get caught in the snares and shit, though. You see a ribbon on a tree, traps are nearby. Oh, say Maxine's on our scratch. So watch where you step. Please, I think I can handle myself. I'm basically a ninja. Skilled in the craft of martial arts. <laughs> Thanks for the warning. Careful around those, okay? Okay. Psst. Y'all are no fun. We got work to do. Not all of us have the privilege of being Marlin's lapdog. Oh, ouch. Someone's a little jealous. In my defense, I totally get things done. I just prefer to think of survival as more of a day-to-day -day task. So, you know, don't sweat the technique. What about everyone else? We need to work together as a team. I mean, sure, yeah, sometimes. You act like you're the only one with a strategy. I play the long game. You gotta have plans B, C, and D. And what if you don't make it that far? Sh shut up a second. I can't, believe, I can't believe they sent AJ out there. He's so small. like a walker pinata
Cut it down, fix the snare, and let's go. I will, I will. Eventually. If you want food for the kid, I can use a hand. Or you can mess around with this idiot and starve. It's up to you. Oh, you can starve. So dramatic. Come to hunt? I hear something rustle around in here. Yeah, let me help you out. Thanks for taking this shit seriously. I'll never understand that idiot. You a good shot? Yeah. Good. I'll chase him out of the bush. You shoot. Last time I was out here, it looked like one of the rabbits had some babies. I'm not sure how many are still around, so careful where you shoot. Aim for the parents. Yeah, don't worry about it. Better to save our arrows anyway. I saw some others run this way. Oop. Sorry. such a pain in the ass to hit. Clem! Clem, come here! <laughs> okay. Ooh, that was horrible. But no, it turned right. Oh, Look, no way. I got one. Poor it's mind. a baby. Well, all meat is good meat. It's not Dang. enough. Release it. Why to get bigger? I'm hungry. So am I. But we'll be even hungrier tomorrow if we don't let him go. Tomorrow doesn't exist, dingus. There's just today. And today I'm hungry. We're hungry. Are you gonna you do wanna, it? You wanna do it? I I'm can't let watch. it go. Let it go. Bye, bunny. Really? Bye, dinner. What are we supposed to eat tonight, then? Ah, oh, I get it. I wouldn't want to kill a baby bunny, either. He'll thank me in a few months. If we live that long. All right. Well, the snares have all been reset and are ready to trap things. We good to go now, or what? I guess this is it. Hopefully next time there are more targets. And maybe some sharper aiming. Yeah, sorry. I'll take this back. You two should meet up with Brody and Violet and see if they've managed to snag any fish. This isn't gonna be enough for the whole school. I like fish. That's great. See ya. Follow me. The girls are probably near the shack. Alright, we're gonna catch some like fish. fish. I once ate a whole shark. No, you didn't. so calm at first with something about to pop off to just mm -hmm. steer the whole entire story. I was just disappointed they didn't get a chance to bait. Yeah. Where's Vi and Birdie? They should be here by now. Clem, look. Uh-oh. Monster. Why wouldn't have just left this out in the open? Wait, isn't that one of our spears? Clem, lock's busted. We might not be alone. Oh, Lord. I don't know why y'all would have stuff locked up in there anyway. You know, you, know, you take everything back to the school. Um... Stand back. Holy shit! Open the door. 
This place is wrecked. Huh? All our supplies yeah. are gone. I'll take a look around outside. Hold tight. Are we in danger? Maybe. Yeah, he did see me kicked out, didn't he? Cigarette. And roll. Is this a Bible page? Clementine? What the hell happened in here? Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Mm, she knew something. No sign of our thief. Thief? Oh, shit. We just walked a mile of river and the traps were all empty. No fish. None. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. Fuck. That's... Fuck. Someone keeping fuck. food. It's just... Probably. Fuck. It's okay. It's... She knows breathe, something. Breathe, Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be fine. Uh, fuck. F fuck. Come on, Brody. You're being too loud. We might not be alone. Just shut the fuck up, okay? Excuse me? Talk loud is bad. Right. I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough here. You guys figure it out. Oh! So what do we do? Eat rocks? We can't eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlon kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. Where else could we look? Let me think. Huh. The train station. It's not too far from here. Uh, I don't know. That's pretty far outside our perimeter. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. All right, fine. Lead the way. Ah, uh, here it goes. Here it goes. Yeah. It... <laughs> had to take a turn. I wonder what that's up about. Cause mm -hmm. she knows something. Yep. Interesting. There, that's where the food is. A lot more walkers than last time, though. It sure is. God. We're gonna die. It's either die here or die from hunger. Take your pick. Clem, maybe you should scope things out. You know the place better. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. Barely got out of here. It was close. It sounds scary. There's a reason. <laughs> I need to get in there somehow. Maybe there's another way in. I could climb up there, but I don't know how that would get us inside. I used that bell to attract a walker before. Could try it again. They do like to follow sound. You look like you've got an idea. The noise from that bell could draw a lot of walkers. If one of us climbs up there and starts ringing it... Lewis, I vote Lewis. Uh, hold on. I'd like to make an alternate suggestion. <laughs> Come on, Lou. You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a walking distraction. Just get up there. The quicker we get this over with, the better. Decisive. I like that in a woman. Just stop. You know what? Stop. Okay. Okay. I'll go with you. Give you some cover. Fine. I'll do it. But if I die, I'm making sure Walker Lewis eats both of you first. I'll distract them until I see you guys reach safe cover. Then, I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck!
Maybe I am. So far, so far. Alpha Clues, no one will ready. What is he waiting for? Come on, come on! Fucking Chris. Just give him a second. We may not have a second. <laughs> See if it works. Gonna need your help on this one, kiddo. You still got your gun? Just in case. Just in case. Good job, AJ. Is there more? Keep it coming. out there wasn't hard to follow you live close by you knew about this place already and organized some effort to get inside you'll understand if I don't tell you anything it wasn't really a question more like confirmation Outside, I'm thinking maybe more. You ask too many questions. I don't like it. Fine. We can play it like that if you want. Now, I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. <clears throat> well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? That's not the. That's not now the that's right impolite. One. Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. I can kill you, you know. Come on, kid. I'm faster than you. 
Listen up, Squirt. You're gonna quit pointing that gun at me and let me go by Mary. You understand? I'm just gonna take a little bit, then I'm leaving. What you wanna do? Attack him! Okay. AJ, get down! You piece of shit! What the fuck? Just take a bag and fill it up. Right. Telling you the place was ransacked. It's fine. We'll deal with it. Mm -mm. You know some too, then. Yep. Took y'all a while. How poor are they that have not patience? A sim, Mitch, check it out. Food. That's like a lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. I can't believe this. Look at it. You're our savior, Clem. Like, seriously, it's a lot. I owed you. You all saved me first. <laughs> Call us even then. Where did you find all this? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have yes. even more. But we ran into the creep that fucked up our fish traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty-ass Bible cigarettes. He had weird, different colored eyes. Uh -huh. Did he follow you? Nope. I shoved him into a pack of walkers. They took a chunk out of him. It was awesome! Look, I don't know if he got out of there, but if he did, he won't make it for long. You attacked him? What the fuck? If he survived, you know he's coming back for revenge. Girl, he bit. Dead. What the hell were you thinking? Don't come at me. Don't come at me. <sighs> this is fucked. Wanna try stepping back, Brody? I'd recommend it. I'd recommend you getting your head out of your ass before we're all dead. I just can't. I won't. Just not again. Fuck! What the hell's going on here? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means. Enough. Just means there's a hungry guy out there looking for food. It's happened before. You are overreacting. You can't be serious. Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. Oh, dang. If anything happens, I'm holding you responsible. All right, then, bet. And don't touch none of the damn food, then. Exactly, that dude. Clem. I know I asked you for help. You did. You did. But... Shit. God. Nothing's easy. Sorry I went outside the safe zone. I didn't see any other option. Yeah, I know. It's just hard keeping this together. <laughs> well, at least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Um, I'll go talk to Brody. Thanks for the haul, Clem. You guys should go enjoy it. You've earned it. Don't sweat it, Clem. Ever since we lost Sophie and Minnie, Brody's been freaked out by anything that happens past the safe zone. 
She'll be all right eventually. Still, we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna go clean up. I think I'll go too. See you later. Don't worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get to people. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. Dying's not scary. I mean, it's sad, but not scary. Being a walker is a lot worse than being dead. How do you know? Maybe being a walker is really nice. Oh. I doubt it. Me too. But it's not like you can go ask one. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now, instead. Sophie was awesome at making stuff. He's an artist. She'd build a place big enough for all of us to live. And paint it too. And Minnie'd be playing whatever new song she wrote. I guess that doesn't scare me because I know I have something waiting on the other side. Someplace safe and happy. Looks like a nice place to wind up. Yeah, I think so too. A lot better than some smelly old school. Uh, who are those guys? The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is, everyone gets to be a person again. Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably looked. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. But sometimes I draw this too. Can... can I be there? Sure. You want to be there too? I promise I'll draw you well. Sure, why not? Oh, I almost forgot. Huh. Okay. Here you go. Ooh, something doesn't it's hang up. yours. It's ours. It's getting late. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. I can't wait till we find out about his story. I want to know what happened. Stand back. Oh, you gonna kick that damn door. <laughs> Jesus. Time for bed, little guy. Can I stay up? Nope. Two more minutes. Mm -mm. Tell you what, you lay down, and then we'll see. Exactly. Your butt gonna be asleep. <laughs> you got in bed by yourself. Eventually. I like it here. We gotta go hunting. And there were so many rabbits to shoot. Whoosh. Well, I didn't kill that one, but you know. Yeah. It's nice not driving everywhere or running away. But the ranch was nice too. Before the blood. This isn't the ranch. Do you like it? I like it. Now that I'm used to it. There's games and the walls make it feel safe. It's good for now. But places change, so do people. It might not stay good. 
Don't worry. We're not leaving. There. You gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you blow out the light. All right. Give me a minute. There. You have to water flowers. Not these. They're fake. So they never die? Never. Well, lucky flowers. But they're not as pretty. Oh, dang, AJ, Jesus. There. That's a good drawing. He's a good artist. Your picture is good, too. Oh, I know. So used to lugging this everywhere, never knowing when we'd find any supplies. I feel a lot lighter. Okay, yeah, I think I'm back. I think I'm good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, blow out the candle. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let a walker bite. And if they try. I never let him bite. Come on, play it right. One time. Bang. <laughs> Good work. And thanks. Brody, Brody got issues, man. What the hell? There's voices in the pipes. I think someone's in trouble. Is it us? No, no, no. Not right now. But we should help them. If it's a monster, we should kill it. I don't think it is. You got your gun. Uh-huh. Be right back. Stay safe. Yes, stay safe. Are you okay? They sound mad. Okay, Don't worry. Check on you. I'll find out what's going on. I'm not. Alright. Alright. Okay, yeah, of course. Ain't a person to look at the bed.
wrong point of vantage anyway. According to the map, there should be another entrance to the basement around here. Of course. Alright, so cellar, cellar, door. Oh, we just came in from right here. Uh, what's this? Probably gonna need that. Mm. No, cellar, door right here. some shut eye. You had a busy day. I was asleep. You guys woke me up. So sorry about that. I, I didn't think anyone would hear us. You want to tell me what's going on? It's really none of your business. Go back to the dorm. Oh, we shine lights in folk faces now? The man you met at the station. We got history. Brody! Don't listen to her, Clem. She's acting crazy. She gets this way sometimes. She's just got to tune it out. Let her speak, asshole. Oh, excuse me? I want to hear what she has to say. How do you know that guy? Marlon let him take the twins. Him and his people. Brody! Oh, God. Dad's sisters. I thought they were killed by walkers. That's the story we told everyone. Shut up! Because Marlon was so ashamed hey, of what... Shut up! Oh, no, oh my God! Uh, what'd you say? She... I'm sorry. Shit! What have you done? I'm so sorry. So, so... You're gonna be okay. I, I promise. God damn it! Hell! What did you say that, Brody? I told you not to say it! He's okay. Get away from her. Come on. I mean it, Marlin. Step back. Okay. Okay. Just, just stay with her. There's a first aid kit down here somewhere, right? First aid kit? Brody, it's me, Clem. Just, just stay still. Uh, who? Uh, I, I, I can't see. Clementine, remember? You and AJ Bull. What danger? Marlon will kill me if I tell him. He's scared. And when he's scared, he gets angry. No, I have the him. Don't worry. I promise you that. Yeah. Yeah, you will. And you're strong. And he's not. If those raiders come back, Marlon said he'd let him take you. Take us? To make him go away. Like he did. Like he did with ten sisters. So what, he like, give the girls away? Brody. Killed him. Oh, fuck. And you 
actually think I'm not gonna keep this from the group. No. Like, you know, I'm about to snitch like a canary. I'm about to, man. What the hell am I gonna do? See, it's a good thing I didn't trust him. Marlin! Force it in there and lift up the latch. It's about to be on. Why Brody? Is 
she a walker now? That's bullshit, Marlin! Clem! You killed Brody. You hit her so hard, her head split open. That's a lie! She gonna see us and all of me. What the hell is going on? Look at her hands! She's covered in Brody's blood! Oh. Wow. I am after she turned into a walker. Jesus Christ, Clem, did you do? Oh, wow. You don't know what you 
you doing, man? Come on, dude, just drop the gun. This is how adults do things, not us. Stand down, Marvin. Be reasonable. Oh, dang. Yeah, that's right. Do that. You don't Somebody get it. Kill. You, you don't understand at all, do you? I'm trying to protect you! All of you! How does pointing a loaded gun around protect anyone? Brody's dead. Sophie and Minerva are gone. You suck at protection. Shut your fucking mouth! I made the right call. I saved the lives of everyone in this fucking school. If they came back, I'd do it again. Excuse me? I didn't realize we were so fucking expensive. They told me they died. I had to save the rest of you, okay? You gave my sisters away. Trust me. You... Easy. Because he's a coward. I wanted to get them. Stakes. Some kind of rescue. Honest, and I just couldn't. I was just too afraid. You killed Brody because she knew. I didn't mean to. I didn't want this. I wanted to save all of you. So nope. Minerva. She didn't I'm gonna want die. to hurt them.
I guess that's the end of this episode. Mother, you have any thoughts? Nope. All right, then. I just, I can't wait for the next one to come out then. All right, then, you guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please like, comment, and subscribe. You guys are awesome. Keep supporting me. I really do appreciate it. And I'll catch you in the flip side.